I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Erie High. I'm Devere and welcome to Royal TV. Today is Friday, February 18th. In celebration of Black History Month, we continue to honor African Americans who have helped shape our world. Today, Deshaun Copeland introduces us to Garrett Morgan. Garrett August Morgan Sr. was an African American inventor, businessman, and community leader. His most notable inventions were a three-position traffic signal and a smoke hood that was used in a 1960 tunnel construction disaster rescue. Morgan also discovered and developed a chemical hair processing and straightening solution. He created a successful company based on his hair product inventions along with a complete line of hair care products. He was also involved in a civic and political advancement of African Americans, especially in and around Ohio. Good luck to the boys' basketball teams. They play Meadville tonight here at home. It's also seniors' night. The JV game is at 6. Varsity takes the court to take on the Bulldogs at 7.30. Go Royals. Spirit Week is next week. Jay Knight has the details. What's going on, everybody? My name is Jay Knight. I'm here to tell you all about our Spirit Week coming up next week. For the first day of Spirit Week, we have Country vs. Country Club Day. Dress in your favorite cowboy boots or your favorite country club best. Tuesday is Sports Day. Dress as your favorite sports team, wear a football jersey, a basketball jersey, you can even wear a soccer jersey. Wednesday, Wednesday is gonna be White Lie Wednesday. Wear, wear a white t-shirt and write a lie on it. It must be school appropriate. Thursday is Purple and Gold Day. Go ahead and wear your purple, wear your gold, and show your school spirit for the whole entire day. And Friday, everybody's favorite Spirit Week event, which is Color Wars. This time the colors are changed. Seniors are red, juniors are pink, sophomores are blue, freshmen are white, and staff wear yellow. That's all I have for Spirit Week this week. Everybody have a nice day. Seniors, you have until noon today to turn in your senior quote. Make sure you check your district email for the link. This is the last call. There will be no exceptions. If you have any questions, see Ms. Esper in room 295. You can help save a life. Erie High is hosting a blood drive today from 8.30 to 1.30. Those who donate will receive a free pair of socks. See Mr. Boyko in room 108 to sign up. If you're interested in becoming a teacher, there's a new program you may want to sign up for. Take a look. We're up against a challenge like no other before. Fortunately, Edinburgh was made for those who are ready to face big challenges, built for those who aren't willing to hit pause, and ready for those who want to see it through to the finish. Yes, the world looks a lot different today, but if you are one of the people who can see a brighter tomorrow, we're ready to help you get there. Edinburgh University, for those who strive. In the fall of 2021, we hope to have a cohort of 15 Erie High students, juniors and seniors, taking some of these dual enrollment classes and then coming to Edinburgh. And in this special cohort, we're gonna support you and show you what it takes to be a teacher. And in this program, you'll be guaranteed a job interview in the school district. Now, this program is for the best of the best students. You do have to have a 2.8 GPA until you get teacher candidacy. When you graduate, you have to have a 3.0, but the employment opportunities for the education profession are outstanding. You will get a job. Think about this. If you have any questions, contest, contact us at, us at Edinburgh University. Thank you. If you are interested in this program, please see your guidance counselor for an application. All applications are due back by February 25th. Congratulations to the new members of the Erie High School National Technical Honor Society. These students excel in both academics and in their career and tech labs. There are 41 students in our school receiving this recognition. Today we would like to congratulate Genesis Garcia, Digital Media, Class of 2023, and Haley Helliker, Protective Services, Class of 2023. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong. Go Royals. February is Career and Technical Education Month. Today we will take a look at our criminal justice program. Mr. Fink, and I teach criminal justice. Criminal justice program, um, you learn about law, 
um, policing, corrections, um, private investigations, crime scene investigation. Um, kind of prepares you for a career in any kind of law enforcement security uh, after high school. We actually have almost more certifications than most other shops um, because there's so many that we can give, but first aid, CPR, use of AED, um, you get certified in expandable baton, handcuffing, pepper spray, self-defense. There's quite a few others. There's a lot of uh, FEMA certifications that you can receive that make you more employable after you graduate. Criminal justice is there's so much that you can do with it. Um, a lot of people that are interested in law and becoming lawyers take my shop. Um, you can go if you're interested in policing, you can take our shop. Um, we teach EMT. I think a lot of times the kids really like to do crime scene investigation. Um, we put up the, you know, the uh, crime scene tape and they have to process the whole thing and photograph and sketch and, and collect the evidence. It seems to, uh, the kids seem to like that a lot. So. You can go and you can work in corrections. Uh, a lot of these jobs you don't really need a college degree, you just need certifications and once you get hired then they train you so it gives you a good baseline for getting a job into this field. It's time for another important announcement from our Erie High BR3 team. No, no, sit down. No, but you're not doing anything. Today we're going to talk about the five career pathways that we have at Erie High. Hey, hey. Stop hey. 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 that away. Put that away. That's the first one. Very good. All right, who can get that? Now you got a teacher attention. That's three. Now you got a teacher attention. Yeah. All right, who can give me one of the five career pathways that we have here at Erie High? Nobody. Nobody didn't give me one of the five career pathways. We had them for three years. There's t-shirts. When you're a freshman, you get it. There's a wheel on the back. I think you should have more. That's another warning. You know, pay attention to class. So we're trying to go over something that's important for you guys in your future. We're done. Alright? So, I think you're an auto body, aren't you? Can I go to the bathroom? I have the bathroom. You can't go to the bathroom. You started class. Sorry, no, you can't go. I need to go. Don't ask again. Don't ask again. You're not gonna get a pass. So we have we have beef head, right? Our business line. That's the one you're in. Okay. Hey class, today we're gonna talk about the five career pathways that we have here at Erie High. So we talked about this last week, so a little refresher, bell ringer. Um, who can name one of our five career pathways that we have? Auto. So that is that is within a pathway, right? So anyone else remember any of our other pathways? Culinary. Culinary, so that is under arts and communication, the red, so that's the arts. Art. Oh, that goes under art. Good job. Remember, there's human services. So that's, that's our nursing and that's our education pathway that we have. And then we have Miss Cutter with her early childhood. That's another one we have BFIT, our business finance. And, uh... Be respectful of teachers, fellow students, materials, desk, and classroom area. Practice positive manners and body language. Respect differences of fellow students, including ethnicities, religions, and abilities. Keep electronics off and away. Arrive to class on time with classroom materials prepared to learn. Be honest, trustworthy, and a positive role model. Bring required materials to class, such as pencils, notebooks, binders, etc. Follow classroom procedures every day throughout the school year. Always give your best effort on classroom and shop assignments. Accept and support classmates even when you disagree. Face new challenges with a positive attitude using problem solving skills. And those are your morning announcements from all of us here at Royal TV. Have a royal day. We leave you today honoring Black History Month.
Dr. Charles Drew was a pioneering African-American medical researcher born in Washington, D.C. Dr. Drew made some groundbreaking discoveries in the storage and processing of blood for transfusions. He also is credited for starting the first large blood bank in the U.S. He was a professor at Howard University and also is the first African-American examiner for the American Board of Surgery. Your morning announcements are brought to you by the Erie High School Digital Media Department. All of us here would like to remind you to stop the spread of germs that can make you another sick. Wash your hands often, wear a cloth face cover, cover your coughs and sneezes, keep three feet of space between you and your friends.